Loading filament on the Evo is easy and requires preheating the machine, inserting the filament, and priming the nozzle. With the machine powered on, press preheat on the touchscreen. Choose the material you'll be working with, in our case ABS, then press N1 or N2 depending on which nozzle you are loading. The Evo will now preheat the hot end to the proper temperature. You will not be able to load filament into the machine without preheating first. This is to prevent damage to the hot end. Once the proper temperature has been reached on the hot end, you can begin the load filament process. Place your spool of filament onto the spool holder in the front left side of the machine, making sure the filament is unloaded from underneath. If using the larger 5-pound spools, insert the spool onto the right-hand side of the machine. The 5-pound spool will load with the tip of the filament going down into the 5-pound extension tube. Connect the extension tube to the end of the 2-pound spool holder tube end using the included coupler. Remove the top window so that you can have easy access to the feeding system. Now take the tip of the filament and cut it at a 45 degree angle. This will help it feed through the system easier. Insert the end of the filament up into the tube in the spool holder. Once the filament has been pushed all the way through the tube and the end comes out at the hot end side, you are ready to load the filament into the feeder system. Go back to the touchscreen, then select Filament Control. The Filament Control screen will now appear and by default, Nozzle 1 is selected. Press load. Now take the end of the filament and insert the tip into the feeder hole. Give it a slight amount of pressure until you feel the tip of the filament being grabbed by the extruder gear. If necessary, use needle nose pliers to apply pressure to the filament. Once through the hot end, the filament will come out of the tip of the nozzle. If the filament is not coming out after loading, go back to filament control, then press prime a few times. This will ensure a consistent flow of filament is extruding and that the hot end is ready for printing. If for some reason the filament still does not flow correctly, press remove and repeat the process, cutting back to the unused portion of filament at a 45 degree angle. The machine is now ready to print.